right, eighth grade, we've got math and day 11 in your AMI packet. Um, your day 11 is adding linear expressions. So this is taking um, expressions, well, well, and just adding them together. <laughs> I guess as the name implies. Um, I've got a couple of examples up here that I'm going to show you how to do. Um, we're going to start off with uh, finding our like terms. Okay, so like terms, meaning I can only add x's with other x's or y's with other y's, and I can only add um, constants, which are just my regular numbers like negative 1 and negative 5 here and 1 here and negative 2 here. I can only add those together. Um, so let's identify what our common or what our um, like terms are. In this first question right here, I have a 2x and an x, okay? I know those are like terms. Um, and then I have my constants, negative 1 and negative 5. And I'm just going to combine those together. I am adding these, okay? So that makes it a little easier. We'll get into subtraction later, but I am going to add these. I'm going to take this 2x plus this x, and that gives me a 3x, okay? Then I'm going to take this negative 1 and this negative 5. I'm going to do negative 1 minus 5, okay? So they have the same signs. That means I'm going to add them together and keep that negative with them, okay? So negative 1 minus 5 is minus 6. Okay, so if I add these two expressions together, I get 3x minus 6. Now, on some of these, you're going to have to do some distribution first. So I've got an example set up here. Um, I'm going to distribute first thing. Okay, and then I'm going to distribute here. That's my first step, distributing. 2 times x gives me a 2x. 2 times 1 gives me plus 2, okay? So distributing that 2 through that first set of parentheses gives me a 2x plus 2. My second set of parentheses, I'm going to distribute this 3. It is a positive, so positive times a positive 2x gives me plus 6x. Now remember, I'm multiplying, not adding. 3 times 2 is 6, and my x. 3 times a negative 2. 3 is a positive, 2 is negative, so I know my answer is going to be negative. So 3 times a negative 2 is minus 6. Okay, once we get to this step, it's kind of like what we did up here where we're combining like terms. So my 2x and my 6x are like terms. My 2 and my negative 6 are like terms, so I'm going to combine those. 2x plus 6x gives me an 8x, and 2 minus 6 gives me a minus 4, and that's my final answer on that one.